is your first Tinder date? <laughs> of course it's not. What? No, I didn't mean it like that. Is this your first time leaving your house since the pandemic started? Yeah, actually I don't really get out that much. Why are you wearing a mask in a park? My mask? How am I supposed to protect myself from others if I don't follow the rules? And since you ask, where's your mask? <laughs> so, you're wearing your mask to protect yourself and others in an open space like this? How are we supposed to get back to normal if people don't take the rules seriously? Have you even had a booster? <laughs> Why what? This is hilarious. So you don't see anything wrong in the way how all of this is being delivered to us? Or how when you open the news, there is either more information, creating more fear around this entire situation, or strong propaganda from them leading us to solutions with the sole purpose of enriching themselves. What happens with creating a discussion? Different points of views. Okay, I can see this is a sensitive topic for you. But let me tell you this. How are we supposed to get back to normal if people like you don't take the rules seriously? <laughs> yes. <Yeah. laughs> Whatever. I feel like this. It's not going anywhere. It's not so nice to meet you. No, wait. That's not what I meant. You speak your mind. I like that in you. You're right. Since the whole pandemic, I don't really leave the house much. And this is my first time using a dating app. Let's speak about something else. I won't bother you again. actually cuter than in your photos. No more superhero. You get to experience the real me. But the video is fine. Just don't bring the superhero back. I won't. Unless you want me to. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> you better be. But I need to go now. It was nice to meet you. Am I gonna see you again? Text me. this workout man I'm not built to run like this I'm serious what's funny <laughs> serious you won't be seeing me back here again of course you prefer to be in the gym lifting weights you know remember you need to be able to move as well you know <laughs> how was he on your date with that girl last week oh I can't even tell you it's like, at first we really connected, but with the same speed we connected, it's like we disconnected. Really? I thought dating apps were really easy. People kind of knew what they want there. It was quite easy. Okay, you're right. I wasn't really feeling none of the girls there. But that's not the point. Okay, what's the point then? As I was explaining, Things just kind of went left. Basically, she was mocking me because I was wearing a mask in an open space. What type of open space? Kind of like this, in a park. I mean, at this stage, I don't really blame her. Why would you be wearing a mask in an open space? It was the first time I physically met her. I don't know her, what she's doing in her spare time or who she's doing it with. Do you know how this mask really protects people? You don't need to know how they do it, and you just need to know that they do it. You know, when people were meant to protect us, don't even know what and how they need to do it. They're only in it for their own financial gains and don't follow their own laws. Things get a bit different. It's, it's not like that. See, when the lockdown businesses, like people couldn't travel, people couldn't, couldn't go to football competitions, you know, and just because people couldn't socially distant, Things get really, really bad. I haven't actually dived this deep into things. Maybe my reality doesn't really affect you. 
But bro, you just need to keep an open mind in the future. Alright. I'm heading back now. Really? You leaving already? I got work to do. And uh, I'm seeing her again, so I'm gonna have to go and get ready. Okay. Where are you going? Take yeah, it easy. Alright. Everybody's talking, you don't treat me like I hope I never have to wear these again. Why am I putting in this much effort to see him? He was so weird. But no, he was actually really nice as well. No, he ain't no good. Well, you had your chance, but that ship has passed. How are you? I'm okay. So, where are we going? I was thinking there's this nice Brazilian around the corner. Uh, Maybe That won't work for me. Why is that? You clearly only looked at my photos. I'm vegan. <laughs> it says that in your profile. That is not funny. Well, careful. Wait. Leave me alone. What do you mean, leave you alone? Leave me alone. I'm tired of you. You're crazy. Me, crazy. This girl isn't well. Bye. Go. See ya. Maria, you're really starting to get annoying. Oh, me? Annoying? Why is it always your way? I know that sometimes my choices are more risky or they don't make sense at all, but I just wanted to do it my way. And all you do is say no. Okay, we did it your way and it always ends up badly. Just trust me. I love you. Well, you had your chance, but that I love you. Ship has passed. Love me. I moved on. You love me. And I'm like, you love Ashley. <laughs> I think it never happened you broke before. My heart, but here yes. I am. What did you Who are you? You yes, might know me. That's because she's my work colleague. I'm going to do oh, anything. No, oh, you are such no. a liar. She told me everything. Yeah, you see, I accept your fault. And you can't even do what I want once. Once? Yes. But don't believe him. What? Make I'm out. Bye. What the? Oh, you are crazy. What you got to do? You ain't no. You look gorgeous. Oh, is that your girl? Sorry, 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 sorry. What was that? People. To be honest, it's situations like that that makes me afraid. Makes you what? Nothing. So, where are we? Where are we eating now? Maybe we could try and find a place nearby. A vegan one. I'm going to be really honest with you right now. I can't be standing no more. My feet are hurting so much from these heels. I just need to sit down for a bit. Well, I live not too far from here. I was thinking maybe we could just order some food, or maybe we could sit at the bus stop until your feet ain't hurting. Okay, but um, just because I can't be standing in the middle of this street no more and it's freezing. <laughs> and this doesn't mean anything, it's just because it's more convenient. You ain't coming back. I ain't having that. You broke my heart, but here I am. Who are you? You ain't no kind of man. No. Oh, no. so much from wearing heels. It's been a while since I've last worn them. <clears throat> Can't feel anything but special when a girl goes to that kind of event. <laughs> no. It's just since the pandemic started, my whole wardrobe got reduced to trainers and tracksuits. I completely understand what you mean. The reality is, I've been forced my entire life to live in this closed box. Just, just to be like some emotionless, arrogant, overconfident person. But that's not me. You know, my mum left me and my dad when I was a little girl. <laughs> to, to, to this day, I can't forgive her. 
How can a mother leave her only child? I mean, I get that. My dad probably wasn't the best husband, but from that to abandoning her only daughter, it's just unbelievable. Sometimes those type of experiences make it hard for the person going through them to trust anyone. I've been into yoga now for a while, just to help me. Are you into anything like that? Yeah. Uh, I do a lot of self-development and a little bit of yoga too. Is that our food? Uh, nah, should be here in about 10 minutes though. What is it? Something in your hair. Let me see. I think it's gone now. Oh, really? I know what you're doing. What am I doing? Well, something is happening and I don't fully know what it is, but it kind of feels good. Darling. Esther. I'm afraid. Don't be afraid. Just be the moment. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. Where's your mask? I am sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry.